producing agent that we have to study is uh, Dibel H that is diisobutyl aluminium hydride uh, if we talk about the structure aluminium have two similar substituents that is isobutyl two isobutyl groups are attached to aluminium along with one hydrogen so this is the structure of dibel and uh, it reduces aldehyde ketone acids and acid chlorides so in general uh, dibel is used for the reduction of aldehyde ketones acid and acid chloride and all of these are reduced to their corresponding alcohols okay so first if we talk about reduction of ketones so ketones are converted to alcohol let's take an example of ketone this is ketone firstly it is treated with dibel H secondly it is treated with water secondary alcohol so ketone gives us secondary alcohol if we talk about reduction of aldehyde aldehyde again it will give us alcohol but in case of uh, aldehyde the alcohol formed will be primary alcohol so OH this will be the product primary alcohol esters uh, are converted to aldehyde So that's a very important reduction carried out by using Dibel H because if you use any other uh, reducing agent like lithium aluminium hydride so in that case your ester gets cleaved and forms two moles of alcohols so uh, But if, if you only want to reduce esters to aldehyde, then the reagent that would come to your saving will be Dibel H. Uh, it's Dibel being a strong and bulky reducing agent. It is used in the limited quantity. So, um, if you want to reduce one equivalent ester, Aldehyde, you will be using only one equivalent of the um, Dibel H and you will have to maintain the reaction conditions for reduction of esters to aldehyde only and not to carry out that reaction further uh, the condition required to maintain is temperature of minus 70 degree so minus 70 degree and that two container needs to be closed reaction needs to be carried out in a closed container so let's discuss reduction of esters to aldehyde It's important reduction very first requirement is 
you want to reduce one mole of ester then one equivalence one equivalent of diable should be added second temperature condition of minus 70 degrees required third closed container the lid of the container needs to be closed throughout the uh, duration of reaction then only esters will be reduced to aldehyde only and not any further uh, let's take an example uh, so this is our ester this ester is firstly treated with diable and only one equivalence of diable in hexane and around seven minus 70 degrees celsius is maintained and the system or the container is being closed after the reaction completion it is treated with water and the product is obtained which is an aldehyde so this will be the product obtained fourth is uh, amides amides are reduced to amines as was the case in lithium aluminium hydride so amides are reduced by diable into amines alkyl halides on the other hand are unreactive alkyl halides are unreactive towards diable while they were being converted into hydrocarbons uh, by lithium aluminium hydride so if uh, somebody asks you about the difference of uh, reduction by using diable and lithium aluminium hydride then you can explain alkyl halides are not reduced by diable while they are reduced by um, lithium aluminium hydride similarly nitriles nitriles are partially reduced to imines and if imines are hydrolyzed then aldehydes are obtained so again in this reaction our uh, diable is different from lithium aluminium hydride so nitriles nitriles are treated with diable they will give imi imines and imines on further hydrolyzing will give us aldehyde So this will be the product obtained first of all this will be formed and this on hydrolysis will give us aldehyde this bond will cleave and oxygen will come aldehyde is obtained so these are the reactions which are reduced by diable 